Donald Trump has a habit of calling women nasty. Here's a list of who has been on the receiving end and why. It's no secret that the U.S. president has been less than progressive on his attitudes towards women throughout his career. Who can forget the now ubiquitous, grab them by the p asterisk ssy comments. However, it's now apparent that Trump has a favorite word for describing women who have dared to express their disagreement or dislike for him. Here, below, all the women Trump has deemed nasty since becoming president. Included in the list are two presidential nominees, a prime minister, a mayor, the speaker of the house, and a British royal. It's almost as if he's threatened by powerful women who dare to speak up to him. Almost. So do what do each of these women owe this great honor? A myriad of reasons really, but they all boil down to the fact that the women don't blindly agree with everything he says. Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex, was notably absent during Trump's visit to the UK earlier this year, amid rumors she disapproves of the president. Before Trump's 2016 election win, Meghan called him divisive and misogynistic. Upon hearing this, Trump told The Sun, I didn't know that she was nasty. Carmen Yulín Cruz, the mayor of San Juan in 2017, Trump tweeted that Carmen Yulín Cruz, the mayor of San Juan, had been told by the Democrats to be nasty to him, so she retaliated by wearing a t-shirt emblazoned with the word, nasty, on it for a TV interview a week later. Your move Trump. Hillary Clinton no surprise is here. The dirty fight for power in the 2016 US elections became even more personal than usual, with Trump regularly calling Clinton a liar and blaming fake news for any negative press surrounding himself. Meta Frederiksen, Prime Minister of Denmark The most recent recipient of Trump's favorite insult is Meta Frederiksen, Prime Minister of Denmark, who called Trump's ideas about buying Greenland from her country absurd. He responded by saying she didn't have to be so nasty. Yes, this is the president saying these words. Nancy Pelosi Earlier this year Trump called House Speaker Nancy Pelosi nasty after she expressed her views that Trump should go to prison. I think she's a disgrace. I don't think she's a talented person. I've tried to be nice to her because I would have liked to have gotten some deals done. She's incapable of doing deals. She's a nasty, vindictive, horrible person. Kamala Harris After hearing that Senator Harris performed a key role in questioning Attorney General Bill Barr earlier this year during the Mueller report, Trump responded saying, she was probably very nasty. When asked about this, Harris, a contender for Democratic nominee 2020, replied, we have a President of the United States whose primary interest, I think that has been clear as a result of what we know from the Mueller report, has been to obstruct justice. My primary interest is to pursue justice, and you can call that whatever name you want, but I think that's what the American people want in a leader. Well said. We'll update this list as and when. Hopefully, it stays as is, but we're not holding our breath. Let's block ads. Why?